Hello! In this video tutorial, we are going to do a quick overview of the new interface for Canvas. Many of you have already logged into Canvas and have probably noticed this new interface, but I would like to take a little bit of time and walk you through a couple of things um, that you can do within Canvas. So as a student, if you want to get to Canvas, you need to always go to Student and click on Canvas here so that when you go to Canvas you are on the Castleberry Canvas login. You are then going to log in with your username and then your password which is your lunch number and then you'll click login. Once you're logged in you now have a new feature which is your dashboard. On the dashboard you're going to see some of your classes that are listed here. But you may not see all of your classes and so we are going to go over here and I'm going to show you how to get to a list of all your classes. Because the classes that are showing up are going to be the classes that have been favorited in the list of courses. So if you come over here on the left hand side you now have your navigation for Canvas going down the left hand side of your page. And when you click on courses here it will list the courses that you have favorited. But notice you have a link at the bottom called All Courses. So if you'll click on All Courses you will notice that here is a list of all the classes that this particular student has and there are a few classes that are not blue links and that is because as of right now the teacher has not published that particular course. As soon as that course is published then you will be able to gain access to that course. If you have certain courses that you want to show up on your dashboard then you can go in and you can actually click the little star in the front of the class and it will turn it yellow. And so any of the classes that you know you're going to want to be able to get into, you can put a little star in front of those. Now when I go, you can see that I have four classes that have been starred. When I go back to my dashboard, only those four classes are going to show up. So what you are going to want to do is you're going to want to go into Courses, go to all courses and you're going to want to put a star next to all the courses that you know uh, your teachers will be using for this school year. And again, if a course is not published, as soon as the teacher publishes it, you would need to come back in and star that. If you do not want to have any favorites and you just want all of your active courses to show up, then you can remove those stars. And now when I go back to my dashboard, all those classes are showing again on my dashboard so that it'll be easy to get into those classes. Now once you are in the uh, your classes each of you should have a class for your grade level and so this is for the class of 2021 which would be for this year our eighth grade class. So we would if I click and open up that class within this class you are going to be able to get to information throughout the year. So once you're here you will see that you've got several um, options down the side but most of the time uh, the things you'll need to get need to be able to get to will be listed right here on this page. So you have two ways to get to your courses. You can just click on courses and then you can go here to select the course that you want to go to or you can go back to your dashboard and the courses will show up here as icons. Now if you do not like the icon showing on your dashboard, notice that up here at the top there's a little toggle that will turn this off where you would be back to how this was last year where it lists any messages that have been sent, any notifications, and any discussions that you have. Also notice down the right hand side of the page you have a list of to do things. You have um, items that are coming up. If you've received any feedback and notice you can always view your grades right here and you would just see your grades for all of your classes there. So I hope this has helped you um, with Canvas and your teachers are going to be taking you through many other 
areas of Canvas as you go through your different courses. Thank you.